What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Fathead here and we are in a little bit of a different location as you can see. We are in my kitchen. So, since you've probably already looked, those flowers that are right there, they're fake. Not real. Just thought I should throw that out there. So, in this video, as you can see, we have new wheels out here. They are a little pricey. Here's the, all the information for them. These are the Pro Forged 1.9 Clear Anodized Aluminum Black Beadlock 6 Lug front or rear wheels for rock crawlers and as you can see they are a little steep but i didn't pay that much for both of them i didn't pay like 220 bucks for them they were i guess you could say they were on sale so we are going to be installing these on the Unimon and as you can probably kind of tell these are 2.2 Vanquish wheels on 1.9 tires just me and the hobby shop owner down here in Sky or Sea, me and Cody thinking of this idea if two twos on one nines would look cool on this, then we were going to try something, but I mean, they look all right, but they don't perform that well, I guess you could say. So I went ahead, ordered these off eBay. The one thing I just noticed after I bought them is I was looking to see where shipping was and you can probably tell, I don't know if you can, but there's no hub. Let's see, let me do this better picture. You see? So the, like the Vanquish wheels, to where you have to buy hubs separately. So, to where these wheels right here are Vanquish, hopefully, I'm hoping, that they will bolt up the same but i don't know if they will so i'm gonna take this tool from hpi racing the seven millimeter wrench it's worth the money it's like 18 bucks or something like that but it's so much better than the cross wrench so glad i made that purchase so no further ado, let's get this started. I'm gonna take these wheels off and get these other ones on. See you guys in a minute. Okay, got them all off. Set those aside. Just get the truck out of the way. So I'll scratch that table. More than it already is. So next step. Is to remove these five screws on the back of this wheel. So let's go. Alrighty. So got all the screws out. So now let's take these out carefully because they were stretched pretty well to get these on there. Got that ring out. Now let's push this inner bead ring out. I had a friend doing this one time, and the um, tires got like fused to this ring right here and couldn't get them off. So he had to cut them. But so now we got to get this silver ring out of there. And that was just a battle itself to 
Get that even, get that in there. You gotta like do it evenly all the way around. Or else you risk ripping your inner foam. So these tires, they do stretch a little bit. So you can, as long as you're easy and you're slow, they'll come out. But like, yeah, so. Pop those down, just put those together. You don't lose pieces. That's what these wheels look like. They'd almost be, they'd almost, they'd look cool too if this color scheme was reversed. To look, I guess, something like this. But, alright, so let's get these other ones taken off. Boom! Yeah, that was a little terrible little thing I did, but. Gotta spice it up somehow. Alright. So, let's get those like there, like so. Get those off to the side. And if you guys were curious, I did squeeze, or oh, well, squeeze, I did keep the 1.9 Proline dual stage foams in here and stretch that fat 2.2 ring on the Vanquish wheels over that. So, move those screws over here. That's a piece of breakfast, anyway. Well, here's gluing instructions for what we are doing. We don't need to worry about that because that's just gluing. So, throw that off to the side. Get the knife. Open. Check the bag for anything else. Nothing. Nope, no hubs. So let's grab one of these wheels, grab the touch all down, grab the tool, I hope this works. Three more to go. Two more. Last one. Okay. I mean, I don't see why they won't, but moment of truth. Oh, oh, and they do, I think, yeah, let's find out, let's get them screwing in, got that one threaded, go directly across, So that's a little tight, so let's loosen the top one so we can get these evenly distributed. Okay, that broke loose. Okay, get those tight. Those tight. And then let's just get these bad boys put back in here. We'll listen to this noise real quick. No, it wouldn't do it since. There we go. Anyway, get the point. One down. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Look at those boys. Check that out. 
out. I like these a lot. So good. Took way too long to put on just because they're double beaded. But, oh yeah, I'm happy with them. They look good. I think they're worth the money. Went together seamlessly, but did admit we are missing two, just two screws that came in one of the packages, and this wheel is missing two screws, which isn't a problem because I got um, screw, hundreds of screws laying around in my bins and drawers and stuff as screws. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Um, let me know what you think about these wheels. I like them a lot. I think they look pretty decent with this body. So. Well, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment on anything that you like, didn't like, um, that you want to see later on, eventually, whatever. Well, thank you guys for watching. This is Fathead. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.